Morning everybody. Uh, just thought I'd do a riding review of um, a new Bluetooth unit I've been and bought. Um, it's called the FOD Sport. Uh, I think it's FS6. Because the little Freedcom I had that packed up on me, that was a uh, last number redial one. And I was out the other week and that wouldn't work. I do everything bar dial so I ordered this new one off Amazon and that came and I've set it all up that's in the crash helmet now and I've just tried it I've just called the missus on it and um, it works a treat how long for I don't know I mean it's not a a review to say yes it works brilliant after X amount of time but so it's the first time I've used it um, it's uh, how do we put it when you switch it on it tells you that it's powered up it tells you that it's connected um, and you have to press the big button on the middle of it X amount of times to get different modes on it um, it does voice dial so it'll work with um, Android and um, Apple uh, you just press it twice and it'll come up with like voice dial and then you just say I don't know say call home or call whoever and that'll dial them um, it's got FM radio on it you can play uh, music through it if you're using your phone as a sat nav that'll all run through it um, I think it was yeah, I think I said it was about 70 quid 72 quid something like that um, yeah, it was easy to fit no problems I'll put a picture of it up on the screen just here and uh, yeah that's that's what it is but um, the only problem I found with it I mean it's not any fault of the unit itself I think it's my voice and my accent because of uh, originally come from Norfolk and a lot of people said I've still got my Norfolk accent it, it's that because um, I pressed the button and said dial home and it come up with four or five different options of people I'd got on my call list on my phone and when you say which one that didn't really recognize my voice as such you know then I just dialed the other one for the missus's mobile and it worked but that's that's the only problem I've got with it but that's that's not really a problem as such I still managed to get hold of her um, I've not tried it as a sat nav as you, through the sat nav yet but the other thing with it is it's nice and loud it's stereo and you can connect it to I think there's six other crash helmets so if you're out in a group you can connect it to other riders and it's got a fair distance on it as well I think that's um, about 120 meters I think that's a fair old way so but I, I don't use it for that I use it just as a Bluetooth thing yeah I just use it as a Bluetooth and um, so if you're in the market for a new one if you're looking yeah I'd give it a look I mean it might not suit your purposes but it suits mine yeah it suits my purpose um, but yeah I'll say I've, I've already put a picture in there it's simple to use I'll say it's not much a review it's just my own personal feelings on the unit itself in the packet you get the speakers that go in your crash helmet velcro in you get two microphones one of them is a hard boom 
uh, one so you can use it in an open face or a flip front crash helmet and the other one is a soft wire so and that velcro is in the front of a um, full face and that's that's the one I've got in at the moment so anyway I hope that's of help if you're after a new Bluetooth unit so with that we'll talk to you all again soon ride safe everybody take care bye for now